Some may say that the T-Mobile G1 may have no practical use by today's standards, other than a piece of nostalgia for yesteryear. Fortunately, Android is more resilient than that. I'm Joe Levi for Pocket Now. This is going hands-on with the T-Mobile G1 and putting to rest once and for all, Android fragmentation really doesn't matter. One of the things we use our handheld devices for is social networking. As you can see here, Facebook works, although the layout is somewhat different, the speed isn't all that great, and it's a little bit different of a user experience than what you've come to recognize and expect. If you're looking for a Twitter client, you're not going to find one. There is no official Twitter client that supports Android 1.6. However, Hootsuite is available and it consumes both Facebook and Twitter information. If you're looking for other social networks, Google Plus is missing, as is Pinterest and Instagram as well. However, some of the others, like Instagram, have some more generic third-party versions that let you tie into their service. If you're looking for a note-taking app, you can give up your Google Keep, but Evernote, Evernote works just fine. Of course, what a smartphone is really for is making phone calls. So as you can see, the dialer looks a little bit old, but it's still the dialer. It still works, it still functions, it still makes and receives phone calls very, very well. Of course, you also have your contacts, you have text messaging, you have calendar, you've got all the stuff that you need and all of that works today the same as it did way back when this was introduced. So there you go. We took a look at some of the things that you could and some of the things you couldn't do with your HTC Dream or T-Mobile G1. As you can tell, there are a lot of things that you can still do even though it's Android 1.6, even though it is a very, very low powered device as far as specifications go. That'll do it for now. Thanks very much for watching. If you liked what you saw, please give the video a thumbs up and share it with your friends on all the social networks. We're there. We'd love to see you there too. For Pocket Now, showing off nostalgic devices like the HTC G1, I'm Joe Levi. Thanks for watching.